Okay, y'all, we back with another episode of Red Dead Redemption 2. <clears throat> we are going to Mary Linton's house because she needed our help with a letter. Yes? Oh, I'm sorry. I didn't mean to disturb you, ma'am. Uh, is, um... Is Mrs. Linton in? I'll go see. Mrs. Linton? A collar for you. Hello, Arthur. Mary? Uh, I heard you and your friends was around. I... Where's what's his name? Died. Well, I'm sorry to hear that. Yeah, me too. Happened a while ago. Pneumonia. Bad business. Sure. So, uh, well, you've been, <clears throat> you've been made a widow and you come here looking for me, is that it? No, ain't like that, Arthur. Oh, okay. I, uh, my family, I need your help. You mean the family that always looked down on me? You want me to help? It's my little brother, Jamie. <laughs> I always liked Jamie, at least compared to the rest of them. He's broken Daddy's heart. Daddy has a heart. Don't make me beg you, Arthur. My money, my life, me. I wasn't good enough. I'm sorry. We need your help real bad. Little Jamie's joined the Chelonians, that strange religious order. Good for him. They're quite mad, Arthur. They'll kill him. You're the only person he'd listen to. So, I'm too rough to marry into your family, but it's okay to ask me to help in saving your family. I'm sorry. I understand if you don't want to help me, but... But I think of you often. A long time ago now. I'm begging you, Arthur. I say let Jamie live Jamie's life and not the nightmare that his daddy dreamed up for him. Jamie's so innocent, Arthur. Please, Arthur. Will you help me? Where is it? Somewhere out near Carmody Dell, I think. The rancher there said he'd seen him around the Cumberland Forest area. I just want him back, Arthur. If you find him, bring him to me at the station. I'll see what I can do. I'll owe you. You already owe me. Okay, let's look at the map. So I'm Mary Linton's quest. Here it is. Uh, let's go. I found out you can also get rid of the bounty. You can pay the bounty off, but it's only twenty dollars, so I'm not worried about it. And I was still from stealing the horse the first day I was playing it. Or the first few hours I was playing. All right, let's go to Mary Linton's quest. Trying to check if any animals are out. Just in case we see some hives or some predators or anything before we get on our way. Please bear with me up uh, my... I'm starting to come down with a little sweat throat. Changing the seasons has really gotten to me. Could have been disastrous, but thank you guys for watching and being here. And oh, we're almost here now. So
<clears throat> Shell of safety. Shell of safety. Can I speak to the boy? Arthur? Hello, son. Your sister is very worried. The boy has chosen a path, sir. The path to truth. Well, I mean, his sister just wants to speak with him. Arthur, I've chosen a path. The boy has chosen a path. He's chosen safety. What path have you chosen, sir? I don't know about this nonsense. Let me speak to the boy. Dut, dut. Are you always this negative and antagonistic, sir? I'm not a very cultured man. Forgive me, please. <laughs> I am a fool for my God and a happy one, sir. I bless you. What do I dream about? Who are my heroes? Let's entertain this and pick turtles. I have no idea. Um, turtles. Yeah, turtles. <laughs> oh, it's on our shirts. Love turtles. I love them too. Turtles. Um, Jamie knows the truth. But of course, you may speak with him. Exactly. If your teachings are so great, what harm can I do? I'm... I'm not... I'm not coming with you, Arthur! Just come and speak with Mary, then break up your mask! Arthur, I didn't ask for your help! So get on this stuff. For Christ's sakes, Jamie, just hold up a minute. This is none of your damn business. Just stop and let's talk about this. You pop up out of nowhere? I have to watch the horse's health. Like the faster I go, the faster he goes. Gun down. I warn you, Arthur. I'm. I'm gonna. I don't want to live anymore. Kid, just calm down. Leave me alone. Now calm down. Let's go 
Go see your sister. Okay. <laughs> okay. <laughs> okay, kid. Have I been a terrible fool, Arthur? I don't know. I don't know enough about it. But one thing I do know. There ain't no shame in looking for a better world. I miss you, Arthur. Are you and Mary sweet on one another again? Oh, no. That's all a long time ago, son. And this wasn't how I thought today would turn out. You spent a long time, Jamie Gillis. You were a kid last time I saw you. you didn't try to kill yourself. You know, you taught me how to ride a horse. Too well, apparently. Spolia, though? Really? You'd fall for that? They were very nice to me. They're decent. Sure. Please tell me you didn't give them any money. Of course I did. They rely on charitable donations. Jesus, Jamie, come on. I just wanted to believe that there might be something good coming my way one day. Guess that's dead in the water. With the turtle. Shut up. <laughs> All father kept telling me was, you won't amount to anything. You're not enough of a man. I had to get away. I couldn't take it anymore. Forgive me, but your father's a bully and a coward. Don't listen to him. Hey, don't talk about him like that. What do you want me to say, Jamie? He's a good father? Nice man? He won't be happy I saw you. Please send him my worst regards. Thing is, he's right. I'm not good at anything. Come on, that ain't true. Tell me something you like. Um, uh, well, uh, don't think too hard. Apples, I guess. Apples? Yeah, I love apples. Okay. I was thinking more along the lines of carpentry or horses or something. But, all right, go work in an orchard. By that token, you must really like shooting and robbing people. I only like shooting young idiots who run away from me when I'm trying to help them. Father told me what you do. I'm sure he did. Hey, are you still with Dutch and what was his name? H Hester? Jose. Yep, still the same, sort of. And Annabelle and Bessie? I'm afraid they're dead. Shit. Maybe Mary did make the right choice. No doubt, but none of it is anything like the nonsense you read in the newspapers. So, are you two getting back together? I told you, no. Just ask me for a favor. Here we are. She must be waiting inside. Make it quick or I might run off again. Jamie! Jamie! Come home, please. You've... Father's been very sad. Father wouldn't know sadness if it died in his bed. But I'll come home for you. My boy. My sweet boy. Come on. Oh, Arthur, thank you. Thank you. It's good to see you, Mary. And you, Arthur. And you. I've... You're... Oh, you'll never change. I know that. It's crazy how he's burdened with a task, but then get, gets told that he'll never change, even though the, the way he lives helps her Save her brother. Like 
luckiest man alive and feel like a fool. That woman confuses me and plays me for a fiddle like no one else alive. I trust I will not make a god-awful fool of myself once more, but... Somehow, I imagine I shall. How do you do? All right, y'all, that ended up so here. I want to thank everybody for watching. If you made it all the way through the video, I gladly appreciate it. There will be more videos coming your way. Uh, thank you for all the love and support that you have shown me thus far. I gladly appreciate it. It really means a lot when people hit... Uh, message me and say I really like your videos. Uh, thank you once again for watching and I will see you guys next time